After a nightmare season that included a gun possession charge, the Jets have released running back Mike Goodson. I'm Kerry Chow, joined by ESPN Jets reporter Rich Samini. Rich, why did the Jets release Goodson? Well, this was a uh, ongoing uh, drama here for, for about a year, you know, with the gun charge, the arrest, and uh, just a, a lot of bad things happening to Mike Goodson off the field. And the Jets ran out of patience. And really the final straw, him not showing up to a, a mandatory mini camp. Uh, emphasis on the word mandatory. If you don't show up, you are breaching your contract. And the Jets, that gave them the out to finally part ways with Mike Goodson. I think it was heading in that direction anyway. Once he didn't show up, it became a done deal. Do you believe that Goodson will still play in the NFL? You know, that's a really great question. I'd have to say right now I don't think so because, uh, one, he's facing a gun uh, weapons possession charge in the state of New Jersey, which has a severe penalty. Uh, if he's convicted of that, it, you know, stress if, you know, that could be punishable by up to 10 years in prison. Uh if, if anything of that nature happens, of course, there, there goes his career. He's also facing the possibility of another league suspension. He was suspended last year for violating the substance abuse policy. He could be in violation of the personal conduct policy. So that's another obstacle for him. And he's coming off a major knee injury, which is another obstacle. And then, you know, lastly, what team would want to take on a player like this who obviously has some, some personal issues that he has to get under control. I know from talking to some Jet players, there is grave concern for Mike Goodson. Uh, they, they can't reach him. They don't know his whereabouts, and there are a lot of very worried teammates right now. Has the team tried to get Goodson any help? Uh, they have. They've, they've been very patient with him. A lot of teams would have cut him a year ago after, after he got arrested. The Jets wanted to stay with him. They obviously invested a little bit of money in him. And, uh, you know, but he did not show up at all this offseason. Now, technically, he was voluntary. Rex Ryan said earlier today that he hasn't physically seen Mike Goodson in two or three months. And most of the players said they hadn't seen him since the end of the season in early January. And so I think the Jets have been trying to help him. But you can't help someone who doesn't show up or doesn't want to be helped. And so I think beyond football, this is a sad case and also a very concerning case of a football player who's, who's obviously got some personal demons away from football. A yeah, very concerning case. Uh, ESPN Jets reporter Rich Samini. Rich, thanks. You're welcome. I'm Kerry Chow with your latest ESPN headline.